Hey, good day and welcome to Come On You Sports TV. Today we are previewing the match against Leicester, uh, which kicks off Saturday at 5.30 p.m. Join us uh, later on today when we will uh, do the uh, post-match re report. What's it called? So post-aftermath, right? Um, we'll do that afterwards. But today I've got Chuma with me and uh, welcome to Come On You Sports TV. We'll be back after the break. Hey, hey, hey. Welcome to Come On You Spurs TV. If you're joining us for the first time, this is Come On You Spurs TV, where we talk everything Spurs. Um, we've got a bit of a Nigerian bent to it because that's where we come from. And um, we also have uh, with us today uh, our resident expert and football mad, <laughs> Chuma. How are you, Chuma? Are you okay? Uh, uh, good, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Come On You Spurs Nation, as you are now. Uh, yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's it's, 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 it's Conte's revenge, revenge is what I will call today. You know, because uh, I know after, after the, the end of midweek, you know, it seems they did try to start the lion. I was saying earlier on that uh, we'll talk a little bit about uh, the match in in um, in Lisbon. I mean, a bit, well, not a bit, very disappointing in terms of outcome. But in actual fact, I mean, contrary to what a lot of people are saying. I actually thought we had a good performance, you know. I mean, even though we didn't take our chances, um, we I thought we didn't play that badly. I mean, I guess, okay, things didn't work well, quite well. There are a few things that didn't click quite well. But overall, I thought we did a great job. I mean, we pressed them very high up the pitch. We put them under a lot of pressure. And and um, we actually created chances. We just didn't take them. What, 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 I mean, what, what are your thoughts, Chuma? No, no, indeed, indeed, indeed I, 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 I concur with everything, everything you said, and we spoke of it, um, and it was, was just quite simply it's, 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 it's the case of, of you know, the result didn't work, work out. out. The, the performance, performance wasn't, wasn't really poor. poor. It wasn't, wasn't bad. bad. Um, like, like you said, said we pressed high. high. For, the For the first time, and from kickoff, kick not it wasn't the case of reacting to them. We actually had a pressing game. Yes. In possession, guys tried to move it really quickly. But well, certain things weren't happening. Um, Kane was in Kane's cut was, was, was kind of his layoff cut was, was not there. As such. Way way then you saw the through ball for Richarlison and Richarlison to run on the front squad. Unfortunately, Richarlison made his move too quick. But yeah, that was a goal. Really. Like, and, 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 if you had timed that perfectly, that was a wonderful goal. Yeah, absolutely. And there were chances, there were chances created and half chances created. Yeah. Sporting this bomb made beautiful football. Yeah, beautiful football in this time. You know, you know, and, and I, I think, think some, some people get seduced by beautiful football. And I'm, I'm, I'm a beautiful football lover. You know, you, you get seduced to the point where you think they're making more chances than they are when they're not. not. Yes, you, you can, can dribble past my fullback or my wing back. back. But what do you do with the ball when you when you finish? Do you take a direct shot? What's the end result? Yes, So it was it was a case of that. The result went again. And I think to me, what was really poor about the result was the fact that. You know, you know, it got, got to 90 minutes. minutes. I literally, I literally, I literally tuned, tuned off the game. Then, then I got a text, text from a friend saying, Spurs are behind. One minute, and I was like, oh, oh my goodness. goodness. Last I minute. I thought, like, I knew that. I just in my head, draw. Let's, let's move on. on. You know? Yeah. And then also, let, the let, let me just interrupt and you I, here by saying that we apologize for not streaming live as we promised um, during the week. We had a lot of technical challenges that made it impossible. So, apologies to guys for not being here. Uh, we are back again tonight. And we are doing the um, post-match um, uh, review of, 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 of the um, yeah. of the match against Leicester. So join us then at five thirty, uh, where we do the aftermath. Uh, we'll, we'll be joined by some special guests and some new guests today. So hopefully we'll we'll be yeah we'll be great fun. I won't I won't name them now, but yes, you you hopefully see them um, <laughs> uh, them later on. Yes, uh, yeah. So you were saying that. So, sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah. So yeah, you, 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 I, think I think the, the real, real sad part of it was, was two goals, goals in the last. last uh, a couple of the last, last minute, minute injury, injury, injury time. time. I, I think, think that, that 
that, that to me was, was unforgivable when, you know, like, like we've, we've always said, said that yeah, if you can't, can't win, win, don't lose. Do not lose. <laughs> exactly. And I think that's also, I think that's also Conte's more or less his mantra as well. Like, okay, we didn't win this game. Don't lose it. And I think that is what would have annoyed him more than the fact that certain chances weren't taken. And, and, and of course, you know, like, I get, I get where, where the fans, fans are coming, coming from. from. I would never blame fans, fans for their reactions because, because we all think we know more than the coach, coach, even though we've never done coaching, coaching badges. Badges. We've, we've watched you do so before. We know, we know what happens, happens at this point. point. We know we about low, 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 low block, block, mid block, block all that. We, we know, we know that stuff. So we've never tried to you know, put it into practice. I'm the only picture here, make it happen. You know? And for me, the personnel in that game, you know, we've been saying it for a while. You know, you know, some, some of us have been saying it, like, through like, gritted teeth and, and, like, with, with, with some, some reluctance, reluctance, but I just, just want to lose this skin. And, and the son has, has to make a way, way because he's not... not I wouldn't I mind. mind. And, and especially, especially I felt in the Champions League game that, that you know, you know I, just I just felt that, that would, if, if we're going to use him for the I honestly believe that Conte's plan is for the league, not the Champions League. I don't, I don't think, think he's, he's ready, ready for a Champions League. League. This, this is, is just, just my personal, personal opinion. opinion. I, don't I don't think he's ready for a Champions League. He wants to do well because his reputation has taken him sort of a hit that he's not a Champions League manager. manager. So, so I think, I think he, he wants to do well. well. But, but I look at, at that thing and I think, I'll just, just put Son down and then put Kulusevsky and then brought Son on as an impact guy in that match. You know? And something to do with a chip off Son's shoulder. He was like, come on, team, you know, I'm going to show you guys. You know? And I thought that would be better. Kulusevsky for the second or third game in a row that he has been in. You know, the word some people say is rotated. I say it's dropped. It's not rotated. It's dropped. And... He's, he's come, come on, on and instantly, instantly that, that young man has come on, he has been a spark attacking wise because, because he knows how to create and how to link with the guy very, very, very well. well. So, so I don't know. know. We don't know, know what's what going to happen at Leicester. But yeah, I mean, the, 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 you're right. The, um, the, the thing with Kulusevsky is that he's a playable, call him Kulu unplayable, you know. He's unplayable. Even though you know what he's going to do, he still, he still does it. And um, he comes on yeah. and he sort of has this, this breath of fresh air, excitement that he brings to the team. You know, and I, I think it's a good problem for us to have, uh, knowing which, which one of the um, front three you're going you're gonna to drop, you know, and, or not knowing which one of the front three you're going to drop. Now, if, I, if you remember, when, we had, when Mora came, came in, there was a time when he had some, some little flashes, especially against Ajax in... <laughs> In um in in the semi final, you know, um where he essentially had a hat trick on that day and it took us to that final, that famous final. Now that was that's the sort of impact Kulusevski has. I mean, game in game out, game out. You know, he has this ability to create mm-hmm. stuff regularly and consistently. And anytime he he, he goes forward, it's almost like a consistent goal threat. You know, you have people standing on the, on the edge of their seats every time he's on the ball. That's the sort of player that he is, you know. Now, it's it's a good it's a good problem to have for us because essentially it just means that between Kulusevski and Son, because he, tr- trust me, it's not going to drop, it's not going to drop, drop Kane, <laughs> you know. So it's it's going to be yeah, either yeah. Kulusevski or Son, or Kulusevski or or or, or Richard, Richardson or Son. So it's one of those um, two that have to be um, be dropped and. Charleston is actually playing quite well. He's playing well. Charleston is, 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 is playing. He's playing. He's playing. All star form at the moment. He's, yeah. he's, he looks. The, he looks the more likely of three now to even score. I'm not saying King won't score. Exactly. Charleston's movements are. I think he's really. I think he has been waiting for this stage. Yeah, and and, and, and the thing about about, about Charleston is that he also has skill as well. He's very very skilled. Yeah, he just doesn't run. Yeah, run you know, he can he can dribble. You know, he can beat your man. He can, you know, do all sorts of stuff. He can cross, you know, and he's you know, very, very good in the air. And if he can't, can't, and if he can't get, get, if he can't, can't get, get the ball to go, he gets, gets a corner off your first and he can get throw in. You know, it's, it's, those are the kind of guys he harries you know, you know, defenders. He makes their life a misery, you know? Yes, I wasn't surprised that he scored that goal that got disallowed. Yeah, I'm surprised. surprised. He, he, he's that, that kind of guy. He plays off the shoulder, shoulder quickly, boom. Yeah. And I think, I think yeah, that's, that's what's been lacking is just, I think I've been watching Kane. Kane, Kane has this thing where Kane can, can touch a ball once to somebody else. else. And, and it's, it's not, not quite, quite happening. happening. 
you know, you we can, can talk about Stone all we want. want. Kane has scored his five goals this season, but Kane too has an issue because, because you know, someone says have they worked out uh, Conte's for me tactics, have teams worked them out. I don't think so. I just think. When, when Kuluseski isn't playing, playing those things don't come off as well because, because you have two different sets of players player around him. As well. Kuluseski, I think, has a wavelength of Kane like so in a different yes. kind of way. Exactly. Um, uh, you know, those uh, flicks that he flicks across, you know, either left or right, Kuluseski knows exactly how the time is wrong to get onto the exactly edge. Exactly where we're coming. Exactly. Yeah, and that, that, that's, that's, that's such, such, such a plus. I mean, let's, let's look at Leicester. Now, Leicester are bottom of the league. They played six matches, half a point. They've lost five straight matches. Now, mm-hmm. some people say that's the potential banana skin uh, coming up to uh, coming up to us, come and play. And some people say this might be taxi for Brendan. <laughs> Where do you stand? So, so uh, there's, there's, a, there's, a, there's, a, there's a there's a popular thing, thing online. online. They, they call, call it Doctor Spurs. Spurs. I don't, I don't know, know if you've ever seen, seen it. it. Mm-hmm. So, so Doctor Spurs, Spurs basically alludes the fact. That Teams that, that are going through bad runs or teams that historically have never been they show up and Spurs cures them. them. <laughs> so, 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 so some people have said, oh, we're going to be a Dr. Spurs moment for Leicester. No, 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 I hope not. I pray not. <laughs> but, but, you know, it could have been if we were riding high. I think because of the fact that we lost that match. Well, you know how doctors first work. Even if we are if you're riding high, we still have a way of dropping stuff <laughs> or dropping the ball. Exactly. When, oh, 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 <laughs> so much expect us to drop the ball. Yeah, yeah the, key, the, the, key, the key, the key, I said to our our, our noisy, noisy team was down to the thousand When you lose your first, what, what happens, happens next? next? Mm-hmm. It's how, how you bounce back. back. Absolutely. And on that Conte, we have a once we lose, we don't. I don't think we lost two or three straight with nine anymore. I don't, I don't think we have. have. He's, He's that kind of guy that, that you can't take twice as many. So I think the players are coming in, and they know their heart, heart as a shell. It is what So I think they'll carry it out on Leicester. It's for us to see. But I think, you know, I think I think they are up the way up. They would have taken it easier, I think, if it was, if you if you were just on beat and still winning and get to those points without playing well. I think. They will want to play better. better. This is just, just my feeling. Want, want to play, play better. better. And yeah, yeah, I think it is. Yeah, yeah I, I, I should say I'm taxing for Brendan. No. Yes, I think uh, I'll go for taxi of Brendan as well. I mean, you know, I'm the eternal, I'm the eternal optimist here. So <laughs> I, I always go on the positive, positive one. Okay, so for, for me, right? I mean, if we if we look at Leicester's games this season, right? Um, they they have they've been quite poor. I mean, I I don't know if it's the uncertainty around the squad. Or the fact that they're losing players um, and they haven't had quite good season when it comes to the transfer market, and they've lost some key players as well. So, and I mean, even the guys who are there, they are in the last season of their of their of their contract, and so there seems to. And then Brendan Rodgers seems to be having this um, argument or having a go at his board, even though it's come out and say that they've been very very supportive, and you know, but I mean, there, there is tension in in the club, and it's probably having an impact on the players. I mean, for us, we just need to go and do our job and, and make, make sure we win. But it, it tells you that mm, you, we need to sort of uh, go about the business on the day and go in, go in and, 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 and go for the juggler. I, I don't know what team um, Mr. Conte is going to put out today. Now, uh, people have come out and said that, oh, why go for... Buy seven players in the season or in the preseason, and you don't use them, mm-hmm. and you're having difficulty rotating or or, 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 play, or, or playing your, I mean, your your full squad, and I'm making changes at, at key moments and stuff like that. You know, but I, I mean, you're, you're probably gonna have a view on this, but I, I mean, and I've said this before. We bought seven players over the over the close season, right? Of the seven players we, we bought, one went out on loan, and the other six are in the squad. Now. Whether we like it or not, every single one of those players has had it uh, had a run out, however little. Now, so we have the um, the anti Emerson Brigade, you have the O oh, Play Brisuma Brigade, you have O oh, Langley's Useless Brigade, and then you have the um, um, what's the word um, Dropstone for Kulusevski or Richardson, you know, Richardson. So it's for me. Um, 
is on the hiding on to nothing. Because if you think about it, right, I think Conte knows what he's doing. You know, okay, Bissouma hasn't played. Why hasn't he played? Or well, he's played a match. He played, he played against um, against West Ham, and and that match for me, okay, it was his first first uh, first full ninety minutes, you know, and first start. So okay, he didn't quite do, give a great account of himself in the first half. But I guess he just took getting used to. You haven't done something before. Um, that was like his audition. And second half came on. I mean, uh, came on very well, and I thought he did quite well. It creates a selection um, challenge for 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 uh, Mr. Conte because I don't, I don't know if you ever listen to what the fans say. <laughs> so you know, but I mean, for me, I would I would always 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 stick to what Conte does, you know, because he knows what he's doing and he's been effective thus far. Okay, we haven't played free flowing football sometimes. We've been a bit touchy sometimes, but I think we've been effective. As in, the key for me is getting the results, and that, that, that that's it for me. What, what what did you say? So I uh, I put I put something in the group, group um, uh, uh, Nigerian players group. Yeah, yeah. 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 I, 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 I I put down. down uh, we we are playing front with proactive team, and, and we, we as fans complained complain that there was no plan B when things got difficult. We couldn't we couldn't drag out the results. We couldn't we play dirty when we needed to. Like, if we played play dirty in certain games or certain situations, situations we'd have won cups or titles. Like mm-hmm. We now we get Mourinho, who's, who's very reactive. reactive. Well, on the spurs, was reactive and, you know, a bit of a mid to low block, counteracting guy. And, and we complained complain that the football was poor, it was turgy, it was horrible. We got, you know, gave us much the same. As uh, Mourinho, Obi, briefly. Now, now we now, now get Conte, who's also, also another reactive, reactive manager, manager, but, but his, his own form of reactive football is different to Mourinho's. And, and he has patterns in Italian football and, and stuff, stuff like that. Like. And, and I think, I think it's, it's a case of the grass is always greener on the other side to have a manager. I didn't especially have love for Mourinho. Spurs, at first. Mm. I love Mourinho as well. I love watching his team. I think it's perfect. I think it's a good fit. You know, I felt it was not a good fit tactically. Mm. But you can you never take it away that it doesn't, doesn't matter what happens. Fans will always be fans. And, you know, yeah. oh, the football is all people complaining. And, you know, the pro Mourinho guy is still there. Start of those ones that yeah, still say, Well, it's the same for Mourinho. If, if Mourinho had done this, you guys have killed him. You guys, guys are, are, I'm like, like Why well, is he here? You know, and, and, and like, like I said, I trust the manager. manager. I, 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 I wrote on the group that Davis was going to play against like, 14 years. And I think someone said, Why? And I said, Because 14 is when I attack him. Whenever he has an attacking team, he plays guys that actually defend first. And then, and then move the ball. The ball. When, when he plays these teams that are kind of going to sit back, back a bit, he's, he's going, going to play long. long. That's, That's how, how I see work. Uh, the man has his reason. And it usually works. Work. Nothing, Nothing is a hundred percent in football, as we've seen. Even, even Man City, City, you know, the, the, the popular Nigerian song that says last last. last. Everyone, 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 will get touched. Everyone is going to get touched. Everyone will get touched. And City will get touched. United have gotten touched. Arsenal have gotten touched. And, and I think it's a case of, like I said, it's grass is green and a bit of energy that's down seven sisters old that's those women in red. And, and free-flowing free flowing football, football that's happening, that's happening around, happening and, around and, and you're thinking, oh my God, we want champagne football with Spurs. Spurs. But when Spurs, Spurs have played champagne football and not had the results, the same people were complaining about champagne football. What if people playing beautiful football were not winning? You know, in this case, we're unbeaten in the league. Heading towards the mid to end of September. September. Yeah. It's, it's, it's you know, head I don't like to walk up and how congested the pictures are. By now, we should have played a league cup match where we have blooded in all those players and were screaming about. By now, we usually have played a league cup. I don't know why the delay is there. There's an international, I think, after this week. Unnecessary things happening because I think it's the 9th of November they put it as. You know, just I think it's I think probably the last week before everyone goes away for the World Cup. Yeah, but honestly, I mean, you're right. Yeah, it's, so it's, it's very it's very easy to um, respond um, as you know armchair coaches and and pundits that we all are. You know, and I mean the guys who get paid 
the money to get the, to make the decision is is Mr. Conte. And for me, you get paid on results. You know, okay, fine. Okay, football might not be um, great. <laughs> Listen, I rather play poor football and win than play great football and lose. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> I mean, it's um, I know I know that it's a Spurs way. Yes, of course, that's a Spurs way, but. We rather get the points on the board, and if we're getting the points on the board, uh, however we play, I think that suits me just fine. I mean, okay, fine. I have a bit of flair now and again that you know things. You want things to move in in a, in a, in, a, in, a, in a certain type of way. Honestly, at the end of the day, it's the points that matter. You know, no one gives, no one knows how the matches went. All they see is the table at the end of the season. You know, and when we come to the season, we want to see that okay, yes, we're, we're there or thereabouts. It's early days. Um, match day seven, um, Leicester are, are not looking that great in terms of uh, position on the board, mm-hmm. but they must not be under, underestimated. I mean, I know Brendan is under pressure. I mean, but if you think about it over the last few years, I mean, they won FA Cup, they won Community Shield, you know, and I mean, they won, won Premier League as well. So they, they're not to be trifled, even though granted some of the squad has changed a little bit in, in character, but it's still at the core, they, they mostly are the same, mostly the same team. They lost Casper Chas, Michael, they lost, you know what, they've still got Verdi, they've, they've still got um, uh, Mr. Ian Nacho, they have um, uh, Tel- Telemans, you know, they have um, the Turkish guy, um, he's still there, and um, um, what's that young man's name, uh, Mr. Ndidi, Alfred, um, yeah, yes. it's, it's, it's still very, very much there, and they've still got Madison, and they've got Burns, so they still have a very, very good squad. And that squad can hurt you on their day. So we mustn't take them for granted at all. You know, I mean, that, that's my view anyway. And um, I'm pretty sure that's the message that um, Conte will be saying to, to those guys. And he said in his press conference, look, you guys should go out and be angry, you know, and be angry that you lost that last match and apply that anger to, yeah. you know, to, um, to coming out coming and, and getting the results um, against Leicester. And I hope that happens um, um, this, this evening. And we'll see how, which, which team... Gets out. Let's let's even look at, at team news. I mean, I think as far as I'm aware, only Lucas is out, yeah, injured. Everybody else is available for for selection. If you had to select that team, what would you go for? Um, because, because Leicester, Leicester played, Leicester, Leicester, Leicester don't, don't have the dominant center forward. forward. I could I go. Um, so so Norris is starting as always. always. Uh, I would go. Longley, Longley Dyer, Dyer, and Romero. Uh, Longley, Dyer, Romero. Yeah, yeah. The central, central three, yeah, right? Yeah. And Romero. Yeah, the central, central three. three. Um, and, and Dyer, Dyer and I would still, still go, um, because of the fact you want more, I think, I think you still want more crosses into it. I think, think Perisic has more or less right, right to play, right, play right, more right, than Sessegnon right, right, has. And says you on common as a different, different kind of thing. If you want, want it a more physical game, game. Mm-hmm. so Perisic, um, um, you know, he's, he's still he's, he's picking Emerson, Emerson for this reason. Of, I think Emerson is more of his, his right wing back. Emerson, Emerson is the one that knows his patterns and is already, you know, inculcated into his way of playing. playing. Mm-hmm. So, so I think, I think that's, that's the thing. And in terms of fitness, fitness, I think it's better than the other two. Conte's fitness side. So Emerson and wing back. So first is Emerson wing back. It's still it's still very much the same side, except in this game, up top, I will I will I will bring on I will bring on I will actually you know if he's still very insistent on playing Son, I will drop Richarlison. Okay, that that might, cause, that that might cause a bit of a wrong boss. <laughs> yeah, no, Kulusevski, Kulusevski, Son, and uh, yeah. Kulusevski, Son, he bring back that three, see what happens, and if it's not working, slot with Charles in, in, you know, slot whoever into the, into the thing. Midfield stays the same, because those two guys, their job is not to, you know, a lot of people were talking about Spurs that used to buy creative midfield players. I the guy had Matic and... He had, had Matic and Kante at Chelsea, Chelsea for goodness sake. Which, which of those two, two guys is creative? <laughs> None of them. <laughs> it's, it's not the job of the two in the centre to create anything. Yeah. Their, Their job, job is to, to keep that ball moving, recycling, taking back possession, and, and just moving it. it. And, and they're, they're doing, doing an okay, okay job. job. Yep. It's, it's not going to take one minute to solve the first goals. 
So that's, that's my, my that's my. Thing. Thing. I, I would say I would I would do a very popular thing. Allison might might come off for. For, for if he's going to insist on something, I personally would like for Charles and Kane to accept it. But I don't think this man is going to drop song. I just don't think he is. I'll be very surprised. I guess uh, I can remember his quote and say, when he says that, um, uh, I think it was someone who asked him um, if he would drop son. And he says, son is like an ideal uh, son-in-law. <laughs> yeah. you know, that anyone would, yeah. would, would like to have as, as their, their daughter's husband, you know. So I guess that says it all. You know, he's sort of, um, he's, he's got deep, deep respect and affection for, 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 for son. So, um. Uh, it'll be interesting to see what, what that looks like uh, with Kulusevsky and Richarlison starting alongside Kane, and, you know, but, and then some coming off for, for impact. You know, yeah, I guess um, that, that that would be a good one. Um, so you're saying no chance, Basuma, right? And no chance, uh, Skip. So, so, so yeah, no, no, no. no, no. no, no. That, that, that makes you. That, that, and, 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 and I think, I think he, he came, came out in that press conference, conference and, and talked about, about Basuma. Basuma, Basuma had, had to learn. learn. And, and I, you, you know, a lot, lot of players, players came out and said, oh, you know, he threw, threw a player on. Someone said he threw a player on the bus. bus. Uh, you, you know, that, that, I was like, how is he throwing a player? player? He's telling you the truth. truth. And, and the player, player himself is not coming out to counter it. it. You know, and to his credit, the summer, all I ever see about him on social media, the boy is working hard on his body, his fitness level, he has a personal trainer. That's all I ever see of him. He's working, but Tottenham isn't bright. Yep. So... To come, come here and expect him to do bright things, things, even, even when they gave him the chance, chance to play. I, 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 I watched him. him. He's, he's trying, trying to play pattern. pattern. He's, he's not, not trying, trying to run, run the show. He can't run, run the show because it's a different kind of thing to what Potter had at Brighton, you know. And 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 we're seeing and we're seeing that now, you know. So it's 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 gradually, and I think the first cup match, I think it's against Forest. We'll see a lot of. These yes, guys, the new, the new, the new guys um, feature very prominently. And I think, I mean, of, of course, um, Mr. Mr. Conte is a, a little bit reticent or, or reluctant to make yeah. sweeping changes, you know, especially with the league, because the league is like really the key for us for, for this season, you know. Um, yeah, he yeah. said earlier on that he, he didn't, he, well, I mean, that's your opinion about him not uh, caring too much about, about Champions League, you know, but again, that's, that's debatable. But I, I, I just think that this year, our priority is the league. And I think he wants to sort of underplay our chances um, so that way we does, it sort of manage expectations, if you like, you know. And I think... He's and over doing, yeah. yeah, exactly. He's, he's doing a good job of, of trying to manage our expectations. So, look, we're a young team. We don't have a lot of experience. You know, we, need, we still need upgrades, you know. We, I mean, there's still a long way to go. It's a three-season thing, you know. And all that, all that. So, so at the end of the season, come and you win it. I'm thinking, wow, <laughs> you've done a fantastic job, you know. So, I mean, I, 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 I think we, we have it. we have a chance, like a lot, a lot of other teams who are there, there about um, this this season. And um, I know we 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 we, did, we were meant to play City um, last week. Unfortunately, unfortunately, uh, unfortunately. The, um, the Queen passed away. Uh, uh, we want to express our condolences to the rest of the country for for her loss and may her soul rest in peace. Um, yes, yeah, so I mean, I don't know if not playing City is a good thing uh, or um, the fact that maybe we should have, we should have played them and just got got the one done with. You know, um, <laughs> what do you reckon? <laughs> I, 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 I I felt, felt that. that. Um, regardless, regardless of what, what would have happened against City, City, we would have carried it out on Lisbon and, and then carried it out on Leicester. So if we had been tongued at the Etihad, we would have regrouped and sparked Lisbon and then sparked Leicester as well, you know, as a revenge. At the same time, part of me is like, yes, they've got early in Harlem, right now he's surpassing every. No, is he surpassing or is he more... He's, He's lived, lived up, up to the expectation of the hype. Nine, nine goals in nine, nine goals in September, September already, already. You know, like guys, guy, he's, he's lived, lived up, up to the hype. hype. And then Alan, so right. Right. everyone thinking that Alan will come in and destroy Spurs. Very, very possible. possible. Hmm. But, but I don't mind playing, playing City, City because, because we, we know how City, City are going to play, play. And, and Spurs have an antidote for that to a point. You know, so with them, it's that if you get beaten by City, you say, well, it's City. 
<laughs> you know, if, if you, you win, win, you're like, like wow, wow, a game and what? So, so it's, it's not, not it's, it's, I, I really don't mind not playing them. Anytime we play them, whatever happens, happens. But we're still, I think the blessing is we're still building, we're still playing our football, maybe not champagne, maybe effective, but it's building something. And the players are, they understand, I understand why he's not, I can understand why he's not dropping people because he wants to drop people. It's like, if you prove to me you want to stay in my team, team, why should I drop you? Hmm. And these guys have proved they want to stay in this team. Everything they throw their bodies on the line, go defensively, everybody, everybody has their own mindset in terms of how he wants to play collectively. So for me, I said, just, it was just time and chance, and, you know, everyone said it was coming. It was coming in the sense that, you know, we, we felt not a way we did some kind of certain beginning. All that, that you just breathe it. Well, 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 it is a really tough number. You know, you know, it doesn't mean it, 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 For me, as a first fan, how many years down the line, how many decades down the line, this is a lot. But, you know, some of the newer fans or some of the people who were not too intense back in the day that are intense now, you don't remember things that happen and managers that have had that. So, so we fight somewhere, somewhere not things we've been in. So for me, it's, it's common use first, man. man. Just, Just get the job, job done today. We we'll take it one game at a time. time. Absolutely. Um, you're on Common Use Plus TV. If you're joining us for the first time, please, please, please subscribe to our channel and share with your friends and our colleagues and family. And also, if you need to get notified anytime we go live, uh, please click on the uh, bell button to get notified anytime we have videos out. Uh, we try to do videos at least twice a week. Um, we have one coming up again tonight, uh, the one uh, of the match against Leicester again. Uh, we're doing a post-match um, review and of chat comments and reaction and analysis. Um, yeah, so we're hoping to uh, it, for it to be a taxi for Brendan. <laughs> you know, so yeah, we look forward to that. Um, taxi for Brendan. Let's have a look at what happened last year. I mean, I mean we had two fixtures last year, of course, home and away. Um, I think for me, one of the most exciting matches I've ever seen was uh, that, I mean, we came from 1-2 down to win 3-2, you know, with within with injury time, you know, and that was such a match. I mean, did you remember that match, don't you? Uh, talk us through it. Oh, I, do. I, I do. I, I do. I, um, they took the, the, the um, Spurs, Spurs, Spurs to the King. King, 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 King scored against, against Leicester. Leicester. Yes. Um, so, so I have I have this library of Spurs matches that I I, I, I usually like download, download matches for about full full ninety minutes, minutes. Mm -hmm. and one, one of the games, games that I it's just, just it has a special, special place, place in my heart. Leicester, Leicester Spurs three two because that first half it was they scored they scored and then you just didn't know where it was going and then all of a sudden it managed to score two one and it seemed like they were coasting. 90, 90 minutes, minutes and then Stevie Bergwijn comes on and Doherty came on as well. So that, that match, match was the turning point, point for Doherty. Yes. A lot of people don't remember, remember. But Doherty came on and also Doherty, Doherty was getting himself in position. In position, position exactly. Yes. And it was a ball from Koiberg to Doherty. Doherty comes in, keeper comes out, the ball spills out and Bergwijn lashes it in. Yep. 2-2, 90, 90 minutes. And then, he, oh, that's, no, that was, that's, that's it. 91. And then no, that, that was actually was 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, yeah, yeah, the second minute, exactly, yeah. And then, and oh, then all of a sudden, let's, 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 let's come, come back and give the ball to Telemans. Now, Telemans, you know, thank God for Telemans. Telemans is an ever attacking literal player. I love the boy. And the boy, first mindset was let me put a little through ball in to try and create a chance. He gets blocked off. He comes to, whoever blocks it off, he comes to see him on turn. Uh, puts a through ball in between two defenders, Bergwijn races on, rounds, round with the keeper, and, 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 and so you're in the, 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 the tightest of angles, so you're you know? Tightest of angles, oh, absolutely and, amazing. Absolutely and amazing. Was, and, 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 it was, and it was like, at that, that point, that, that game and the City game, game it, 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 it helped out, it, it brought up a lot of belief for Conte's manner. It really did. It showed where that look. 
You guys can win. You guys can. You can't lose matches if you really put your mind to it and you agree to my system. Absolutely fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. I mean, I I remember And I think he's going to draw that and tell them this is what this game is. Remember what was like last year. These guys, and then we played them the second time. By the time we played the second game in May. We, we had, had common units. We had common contagious units. units. So yes. we were three 0 deserved three 0 and then exactly. uh, and then uh, he, he oh, yes, 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 yes. consolation. Kelechi now scores. Yeah, yeah consolation goal at the end. end. You know, you but, know but we worked out how to play them. them. It's, it's a question of applying ourselves. And in this match, match like I say, we don't take them for granted. You know, we're grateful. We're grateful for what they did for us. You know, they they more or less set us on our way. So you know, but. We're we offering, offering them no favors tonight. Yes, oh, I mean, uh, which sort of brings us to um, a bit of good news um, on the Spurs front. Uh, Eric, Eric Dyer is back in the England squad. Uh, I mean, that's, that's well, absolutely yeah, fantastic news. I mean, I actually think that Dyer has improved a hell of a lot um, against, um, what's the word, um, in, in, in contest team. You know, he's he's been absolutely immense. You know, he's been absolutely fantastic i haven't seen him make a lot of mistakes and if he's done any, make any mistakes he's recovered very well in, in all, all the matches i've seen him play what do you what do you reckon if, if gareth southgate, southgate is, going is going to play three, three at the back, back which, which is what, what i suspect he's going to do because that's what works out for wing backs, backs. Uh, I, don't I don't see anybody, anybody better to play in the middle of that three in england, england english, english player, player than that guy it's, it's, it's a, a no-brainer. No so, so I think I think it's it's almost like that that nailed on that certain for a World Cup place. Well done to him. Congratulations. Um, we 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 applaud you. I think. Uh, and yes, hopefully we'll we'll celebrate with a win uh, tonight. Uh, when we play uh, Leicester. Uh, thanks very much, Shuma. Um, I'm sure we'll be back Thank again you. with our guests uh, later on to uh, bring right. you a post-match comments. Uh, in the meantime, it's. Uh, Come on, you Spurs. Come on, you Spurs. Uh, where, where are you? This, this has been the play. Where, what, what's happened here? I I haven't done... <laughs> I know, right? It's meant to, you know... Yeah.